Good day, YouTube. My name is Captain Darren, and my amateur radio call sign is N4VFR. In this video, I'm going to show you how to connect your Anon to the RF2KS amplifiers. We're looking at the back of the amplifier, RF2KS, and if you want the fastest connectivity, you better use the local area network. You may get away with the Raspberry Pi that's in the inside that has Wi-Fi capabilities, but if I were you, I would go for the local area network Ethernet RJ45 connection. Now, you can get away with using Cat5 or Cat6 Alpha, but I'm gonna use Cat8 right here this is Cat8 Ethernet, and it handles 45 gigabytes throughput. So this is best for using inside a room and connect this to your router. And also see if there's a shield. You want to get a, a good shield on here. So we're talking about TCI. Now with TCI connection with the local area network, that's best. And also in the Anon, I'm going to show you how to set that up. Good day, good evening. Welcome again to my desktop. I have the Anon 7000 down here. I relocated everything. It's now down here and it's turned on. Uh, now we're going to open up the program Thetis. All right, beautiful. We're, we don't need to turn it on. What we need to go first is we're going to click on the top menu where it says Setup. Click on that. All right. Look for this tab right here. It's called Serial Network MIDI Cat. And under that subdirectory, subfolders, we want to select Network. This is where I had that problem all night trying to communicate with the Anon and the RF2KS amplifier. This is what I did after a good night's rest, well, maybe three hours. I woke up and I looked at this title, TCI, and I looked at this, TCP. TCI is an IP address that needs to be plugged into the RF2KS. So follow my steps here. On the right hand side, TCP IP, we want to click on define, all right? And we're going to use this 127.0.1 colon, that's the port number now, 13013. It might vary again on your system and just let's double click on this IPv4 IPv4 we want to select the one that says 127 which is already populated okay just reselect it okay the server is running click on that box now over to, to the TCI leave this rate limit to 100 milliseconds click on define all right now click on ipv4 this is the one you want to select where it says 192.168.1.214 select that and everything else is um, these are three checked and then these four are not checked. And then you want to also 
check mark the server running. Apply. This is the number that you need to write down right there. Okay. Why is that uh, 5001? We want that to be. Let's use one three zero one three. One three zero one three. What I basically did was I just copied this port and just mimic it, put it over here on a TCI. Click apply. Now click OK. We're done with that. Let me bring up the RF2KS amplifier screen. Three, two, one, click. <laughs> Okay, let me turn off my mug. Currently, um, hang on a second, let me back up. Let me turn on, we need to turn on the, the software. So let me just minimize this and power it on, okay. Yeah, I'm muting it here on my computer speakers and I'm going to mute it on this video right now. Here it is. RF2KS. Right now it's connected via universal. We're going to click on menu. And um, if you haven't done so yet with your network, I prefer the LAN connection, local area network. And this is my IP address. That's what I prefer. And uh, Wi-Fi, because I don't like latency, I went ahead and restored, default, save, and apply. That's just me. Wi-Fi would work, but I like the fastest communication as possible. All right, now this is the place we, we need to go. We need to go to interface. Go to TCI. And that information down. 214, I think. And then and then this we're gonna change this to that one three zero one three. Click OK. You wanna save it? Close. All right, here's the universal. On the top right, we're going to click on that or push it. If you notice, when you cycle through, you can see on the uh, bottom left where it says no cat available. Click it again, no, no UDP available, and no TCI available. All right, so why? Let me just double check that it's selected TCI. Here it is, it is. And my IP address, 192.168.1.214. Okay. 1.214. I want to double check. Right there. One ninety two one sixty eight one two one four one three zero one three. We're using TCI. Toggle apply.
Now, go to, to this. Oh, look at that. It came on. Okay, now it's sinking. All right, that's good. So, again, interface, PCI, 192.168.1.214, and that's the uh, port number. So if it didn't work the first time, I mean, just, just go back to it. Go back to your setup network and just double check. Let me do it again, like IPv4, select it and select it and then apply and then click OK. And then you saw that it was uh, PCI is now connected. That's it. And let me show you how that works. Just going to move this aside here. I'm going to bring up Thetis. Move Thetis. So you can actually see the frequency change. Okay, can you? Get there. More concerned with the frequency here and then the VO, VFOA. So we're on uh, 80 meters. Okay. I'm just scrolling through the frequencies. Oh, we're out of band. See it? It's moving pretty fast. 40 meters. Look at all that activity. I want to give you the audio so you can actually hear it. Turn my speakers as well. My speakers are down low. You might get feedback. So I'm going to click on here. So it's like if it were a phone of... How do you say it? Of 20 and that's what Porque suena y suena y suena, yeah, para de sonar y después vuelve a empezar a sonar ahí otra vez. Algo de eso tiene de locura ahí. Eh, Saludos, don Alberto. Con las buenas noches ahí, ¿cuál sale? Ahí, vamos a click on these. Click to see here. Ok, Guillermo. Kilo Fox 6, Hotel India Yankee, Norway 3, Yankee Victor en el grupo. Returning. Eduardo, saludos, mi hermano. Kilo 9, Echo Charlie. Me espero que esté todo bien, mi hermanito, por allá por casita, Roger. Appearance here. A golf a zero Bravo Echo Alpha. A golf a zero Bravo Echo Alpha. I'm just scrolling. Twenty meters. Fifteen. And. 10 meters. Five nine, thank you, sir. There you go. Working. Hola, uh, twenty ocho. Yeah. Um. Big contest weekend. It's the CQ um, WPX sideband contest. WPX prefix. All right, let me just close this so, out. So the the goal of it. Power it off. I hope you enjoyed my uh, entertaining video. Um, pretty helpful uh, with my my pains and struggles and lack of sleep. But 73s, my name is Captain Darren. My amateur radio call sign is N4VFR. Man, I love this Anon. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, guys, please consider to subscribe. It motivates me to make more, more videos. And um, that's it. 73s, have a great day, great afternoon, great evening. See ya.